Hello and welcome my friends to Two Swans, an A6 birthday card with me, Emma Jo. So grab yourself some A6 multifarious white card, a Series 9 stencil brush and some Elements Ink Sundance and just take it for a little bit of a pirouette in the middle of your card. And round the outside of it, add some Elements Ink Russet Orange. Now if you think that yellow needs a bit more help, go back in like I did. There you go, can you see? I'm adding here some Elements Ink Confetti. Then we've gone back in with some Elements Ink Paprika, just for the corners at the top. Now at the sides here, we've got Elements Ink Della Blue. It's rather lovely. And I notice I'm doing it straight across the middle there. Grab a spare piece of multifarious card and just do a quick swipe with it across it and that'll give you your horizon. Grab your stamp set, ink it up in Versafine Claire Nocturne and place them in the centre of that sun on top of the line. Now grab your thimbleweed stamp, ink it up in Versafine Claire Fantasia, didn't think it was Nocturne, Fantasia and then Create yourself a little frame across the top. So the sides will be longer. And as it goes around the swans, it'll go up a little. I do like thimbleweed. Right, snow shrub. Yes, I know. Wrong time of year, is it? Is it? Anyway, snow shrub. So I'm inking it up in Versifying Claire Nocturne and I'm only stamping it three times because it doesn't need to be fussy. Simple is best. Now that's a little bit of Della Blue still on my brush. I haven't added any extra and I'm just creating a shadow. Oh, look. Posca pen, aqua green. She's at it again. I'm colouring in the thimbleweed because that stamp is rather lovely at creating a space for us to colour. So that stamp could be any colour we want it to be and work with any colour co combination. It's rather super. Can you tell I'm, I'm liking it? Well, I am liking it. So I have sped myself up again because you didn't really need to see me colour this in. Now you might wonder what I'm doing. I keep going over to that blue. Um, Posca ink on the craft mat. Now I pushed down on the Posca and a whole blob came out and rather than me use any straight from the nib I'm trying to use what I have on the craft mat you know so waste not want not and all that. That's what's going on. So all I'm doing is dipping my nib into the, the ink on the craft mat and colouring it in. I do love aqua green. Sometimes you might want to go back over some of it because it's not quite as bright as you would like it to be. Now this is coral pink Posca pen and I'm just doing the buds on the snow shrub like so. There we go. Obviously I decided I needed to do some twice. Now I've grabbed my Mondeleuze watercolour pencils and I'm just doing a bit of a line around the swans and over the top of their backs with that yellow. Grab your crystal star sign stamp and we're looking for Glossians because that's the stamp that's relevant but, but it could be any for this time of year. Uh, for whatever time of year you're making this stamp. So I've just stamped it, inked it up in Versafine Claire Nocturne, grabbed a grey from the Mondeleuze watercolour pencils and just creating a bit of a shadow through the text. It won't, if you, if you use the side of your pencil, it's a lighter shading and so it won't stop you from being able to see the text. It's perfect for a birthday card, this. Elements Ink Mermaid, Series 3 stencil brush, Straighten the corners because I like 
to have dark corners on a design because it helps to frame the picture that you're making. Okay, so that's what you can see here going up the sides. And as you do that, can't you see the colours start to, to get another, a second lease of life, you know? Lovely. Right, crack open your liquid pearls. We're going in with mermaid and just going over the top of some of those thimbleweed flowers. Not all of it, just some of it. And if you've got gaps in between, you might want to do some dots down there as well. Just gentle little lines. Not a lot, just a few. Makes it look delicate and pretty. Emma Jo, stop. There we go. Obviously I've decided I need to highlight my thimbleweed again, so I've gone back in with my Posca pen. There we go. Grab your Liquid Pearls Raspberry and just do some little dots on the snow shrub. You know where we've done the um, Posca pen? Just add a little dot of raspberry as well. You could even go in later on maybe with some um, goldenrod stickles just to give it a bit of gold bling. And there you go my friends, you have done it. Well done, well done. <laughs>